welcome back guys. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Hope you're having a great day. And today we are first starting off. I uh, just got back from a run and my first meal is gonna be just a basic fruit bowl with some bananas, strawberries, and a little bit of cinnamon. So we're just gonna chop this up, throw it into a bowl, and that'll be our first meal. So this is great because, you know, smoothies are nice. They're very quick and easy, but I also like to make sure I'm getting in the unaltered fiber from these fruits and berries and vegetables. You know, I don't always want to blend things up because that does break down the fiber a little more than we naturally would if we were chewing the food. And that is the prebiotics for our gut bacteria. So we wanna make sure we're still giving them a more natural type of fiber that we would naturally have from chewing. So I like to do both smoothies and chewing whole fruits and vegetables. So that's why we're just making a, a fruit bowl instead of a smoothie today. So let's get to it. There is a simple breakfast that you can make. This is what I'm having this morning. And something else that would go really good with this, I think, would be mulberries. So you could put on, you know, sprinkle on some mulberries on there. I think that would make a really good addition to this. I think they, those would go really good together. So yeah, that's what I'm having for breakfast. And I will catch you guys later today with uh, maybe another one or two recipes. So. Have a great day to all you mothers out there, and we'll see you later today. Alright guys, so we just got back from hiking, now it's time to make some lunch and it's just going to be another fruit bowl and you know again you can always just eat the fruit by itself. You could eat it whole but to make it a little more appealing to people you know that like recipes we're going to chop this up into a fruit bowl. It's going to have some blackberries, some lemon juice, a few apples, a couple bananas and some celery. So, you know, just find a few different things that go well together, chop them up, throw them into a bowl, and you got yourself a nice meal. So let's put this together.
So there you go guys, that is a quick fruit bowl that you can whip up and it's gonna be delicious and nutritious. And you know, just like the other ones, it's full of fiber, antioxidants, phytochemicals that are gonna help you be healthy. And here is what my girlfriend is having today for lunch, just a plate of oranges. So just a mono meal of oranges. I'm mixing it up with a few different things and you know, we have blackberries in this one. This morning we had strawberries and berries are one of the most nutrient dense, healthy foods that we can eat. So it's good to get a different mix of berries as a constant addition to your diet for the best possible health. They are amazing foods for humans. All right, so this is what we're having for lunch. I hope it'll inspire you to have a healthy lunch yourself and we'll see you for dinner. All right guys, welcome back. It's time for some dinner. So we are gonna make a salad tonight and the dressing is going to be a sweet mustard dressing. And this is gonna be uh, made with two stalks of celery, one clove of garlic, uh, one lemon peeled, about two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, uh, about a fourth of a teaspoon of yellow ground organic mustard seed, two tablespoons of tahini, and I would normally use dates in this recipe, but we're gonna use coconut aminos because I don't have any dates. So a few splashes of coconut aminos. And the, the salad I already have made up here. And so I've got one pint of cherry tomatoes, one cucumber, a cup of organic corn. And I, I'm not a big corn eater. You know, I don't eat a lot of corn, but uh, we had some thawing in the fridge we were going to use in another salad, but we never ended up using it. So I'm using that tonight, and then I've got a couple tablespoons of sauerkraut. And I've actually got uh, half of an avocado buried in there somewhere as well. So this is going to be the salad for tonight, and let's get going with the dressing. Again, guys back to another salad for dinner now this one the dressing actually didn't turn out like I thought it was going to this was another uh, just kind of a, a first try for me I haven't made this one before so it actually tastes to me more like wasabi if you know what wasabi tastes like so this is a I guess could be a raw replacement for wasabi um, it works okay in the salad. You know, it, it doesn't taste bad. I don't think so anyways. You know, you'll have to give it a try and let me know what you think. But I still think it tastes good, but I probably wouldn't label it a sweet mustard dressing just because, I don't know, it doesn't really, you know, like honey mustard, that's kind of what I was hoping it would taste like, but it really doesn't. So anyways, you can give it a try still. Let me know what you think. You might still like it, so yeah. Um, other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed the other meals that I had. You know, still pretty basic. You know, it's how I eat. It's pretty basic, you know, nothing fancy, and uh, it gets me by. So I enjoy it. I hope you guys enjoy it too. So with that, guys, I just wanna wish all the mothers out there again a happy Mother's Day. Mom, if you're watching, you know, I couldn't have gotten to where I am today without you. I thank you for always being there for me. 
and all the other mothers out there, you know, I'm sure you're doing an awesome job, so keep it up. All right, have a great night. I hope you enjoy this salad, and I will catch you tomorrow for another raw dinner. Have a great night. Always follow your raw intuition. Detoxify your mind and body. Be the change you want to see. Small steps towards living better. Small steps to where I want to be.